In lesson, I was going to begin learning in about the Microsoft Office Word 2007 basic tutorial for going to start Microsoft Office Word. Let's get start by opening to Microsoft Office Word. Click on the start button. Next, click on all programs. Then Microsoft Office. Then find Microsoft Office Word 2007 and click on it and open up Microsoft Office Word and I can see Microsoft Office Word is running and have a, another process to start by opening Microsoft Office Word 2007 start then all programs then accessories then click on run Then write the win word W I N W O R D win word then press OK or press Windows key plus R or press Windows key plus R and then type win word W I N W O R D then OK. The title bar is a bar located at the top of the window or a dialog box that displays the window or software program being used. The office button is located in the upper left corner of the following 2007 Microsoft Office system programs. When you click the office button, you see the same basic command available on the file menu in earlier releases of Microsoft Office to open, save and print your file. When you are done word processing, you can either quiet or minimize Word 2007 if you don't expect to return to it anytime soon. You may just want to quiet the program if you are merely stopping work on one document to work on another. You can close the document and then open another. Or you can use the minimize button to hide word while you are of doing other things. A cursor is the pushbar and this is tab, home, insert, page layout, references, mailing, review, view and that is ribbons. A cursor is the position indicator on a computer display screen where a user can enter text. This is text area. You can type any text here. The horizontal and vertical rulers in Word are often used to align text, graphics, tables and other elements in a document. To show or hide the horizontal and vertical rulers, click view ruler at the top of the vertical scroll bar. You can drag the vertical scroll bar up and down to see parts of a document that are currently not visible. You can also drag the horizontal scroll bar left and right. Or you can hide scroll bars if you want to display more of the document by default. The horizontal and vertical scroll bars are shown. The status bar in Word is available at the bottom of the document window and displays information about your document such as what page you are currently viewing how many words are in your document and whether any proofing errors were founding and language in microsoft office programs such as excel powerpoint and word the view buttons are a features that let you change how the presentation or document appears. In Microsoft Word you have the option of print layout, full screen reading, web layout, outline and draft views. Their last option is zoom tools. Thanks for watching my video. Please like and share this video. Subscribe to my channel for more videos on YouTube.